I'm Lester Holt. Tonight on Dateline, a wealthy doctor disappears and his wife discovers that the man she married was a man she never knew. I said to him, Mark, I know who you are. I know what you did. How could she know that right then, another woman an ocean away had just fallen for a mysterious American, about to commit to all his promises and dreams, and about to learn the truth. Coming up. I was not thinking, what are you doing, Monica? It was just because, uh, yeah, love. Love and more lies. Apparently, Mark is not who claimed to be. Pour My Ear, nestled on the Italian side of the Alps, looks like something you'd find in a storybook, an appropriate setting for a saga like this. Very little about the newcomer. They remembered he rented this apartment and that when he first came to town, he did so in style. Now Monica Spagonia was filling police in on what she'd learned about him, how he might not be Mark Stern at all, but someone called Weinberger, wanted by the FBI. It was a fascinating story, but police were going to need more than Monica. These days, Monica rarely thinks about her old boyfriend. She's too busy creating music with her new rock band. I'm alive. I'm taking my life. I'm enjoying my life 100%, for sure. And thanks to our colleague Rob Stafford from NBC station WMAQ in Chicago. That's all for this edition of Dateline. We'll see you again next Friday at 9, 8 central. And of course, I'll see you each weeknight for NBC Nightly News. I'm Lester Holt. For all of us at NBC News, good night.